Wow. You know, if you're ever thinking, gee, the weather doesn't look that good. Uh, I don't know if I should go out. Just do it. It was raining. I left St. Paul after a conference. And I'm like, I'm going to go home through Crick's Meadows. And then it started raining. I'm like, uh, I don't know. Well, the rain quit, and I found this pond with about 40 <laughs> trumpeter swans. I was trying to shoot through some of this red foliage and blur that out in the foreground and focus on the trumpeter swans. My buddy's here in the background that you can hear. There's uh, three dozen maybe. <laughs> but uh, yeah, well, I got some interesting stuff. Yeah. Wow. Wait till you see how the weather and the light change dramatically in the next 10 minutes. And then the sun broke through with these dark cloud background and it's made for some really amazing, interesting photography. Yeah, we'll see how those turn out. Um, swans are so white and the water gets really dark in that low light, low angle sunlight. Um, yeah, could be interesting. Unbelievable. The, you know, the fall colors are kind of peak here with the oaks and the birches. Let's see if we can get some backlit stuff now. Gotta, gotta put it in gear. Got some amazing front lit stuff. Time to get some, uh, yeah, see if we can get some backlit swans. And now I'm gonna, sunset is nearly upon us and I'm gonna go see if we can get the Sandhill Crane fly in. It's mid-October, what is it, October 14th. It gets really good in a couple weeks, but yeah, we'll see what we can get. Here come the crane. Right there, right there, right there. Okay, we gotta get to the spot where they're gonna roost for the night. And uh, yeah, here they come. Lots of flocks out there. Ooh, just like. All right, here we are. Crex Meadows is a major migration stopover for the greater sandhill cranes, and there can be upwards of 
15 to 20,000 birds on the refuge in late October, early November. It is nearly dark out here. I got here a little late. I missed some cool photos of them, uh, cranes coming in silhouetted against some crazy sunset clouds. But I think I got some other cool stuff. But yeah, my time with the trumpeter swans was definitely the highlight. And it is well past sunset and I'm shooting a little video and it's amazing. I'm shooting this 8K video and it looks like it's daylight out, but it actually looks more like this. On my way out of Crex, like an hour after sunset, I came upon this cool scene with his reflections of these cranes, and it provided me with my two favorite photos of the entire trip. So you never know. Keep shooting. Don't stay home because of weather. Get out there. You never know what's going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> 